While executing death row inmates in Arizona is broiled in politics and controversy, it's personal to Carol and Roger Fornoff. I know how long we waited. We waited for so long to that happened to our the murder of our child, our beautiful Christy. In 1984, their 13-year-old daughter, Christy Ann Fornoff, was on her newspaper route collecting money at a Tempe apartment complex when the complex custodian, Don Beatty, pulled her into his apartment, then raped and suffocated her to death. Don Beatty was put to death in 2011, 27 years after the Fornoff's daughter was taken from them. When it finally happened, we were like shocked. Oh my gosh, it's actually going to happen. And, and yes, it did help us. It, it helped the family heal. That's why Friday's announcement by Governor Hobbs and Attorney General Chris Mays is difficult for the Fornoffs. Hobbs announcing a commissioner will now review how the death penalty is carried out, including how the state gets and uses drugs and chemicals for lethal injection and gas chamber executions and the processes in place for conducting them. After complications with a 2014 execution, they were put on hold and didn't resume in the state until last year when three inmates were put to death. We just want to make sure the practices are um, sound and that we don't end up with uh, botched executions like we've seen re recently. This past November, Murray Hooper was executed in Arizona for the 1980 murders of Patrick Redman and his mother-in-law. Hooper and two other men also attempted to kill Patrick's wife. On the day of execution, Patrick's kids wrote a letter saying, quote, we opposed any clemency for Murray Hooper. Hooper is a paid hitman for the Chicago mob. They shot everyone in the head, shooting our dad twice and then cutting his throat from ear to ear. Murray Hooper did that. It's just a shame that Hooper can't experience a death like that. He will get a nice, easy one. Both Governor Hobbs and Attorney General Mays say the review is necessary for ensuring executions are humane. The Fornoffs say what was done to their sweet and innocent daughter was the furthest thing from humane. It is not cruel and inhuman to be put to death for something that you purposely did. That is the law of the land. The governor says the commissioner of the review will eventually provide a final report that includes recommendations on improving the transparency, accountability, and safety of the execution process. Currently, there are 110 inmates on death row in Arizona. Derek, back to you. A lot of strong opinions on this. Brianna Whitney, thanks for that.